Hello everybody. Uh, today you're with me, Bones. Sorry, I'm kidding. Uh, and we are doing the Strength Deluxe Edition. Now I don't know much about this game, other than it's louder than I thought. So I'm just gonna turn that down a little there. But what it is here is that uh, this was free for a day on Steam. I grabbed it. So we're gonna try it. I literally know nothing at all about the game. This humanity was for sale, and he sold it. The remote sent me into decay. This is my story, and these are my regrets. He's got a big head, doesn't he? Like Conan O'Brien, maybe. Excuse me! I'm looking for Miss Goodwin. He's not here. Boy, I guess it's not this one. So, in the story so far, we're looking for Miss Goodwin. Anyone home? Who's there? Miss Goodwin? No, she lives next to the door. Thank you and goodbye. I know we're looking for Miss Goodwin. Let's close up window. I'm looking for Miss Goodwin. Is this the right address? No! Get lost. Huh, I can swear she lives somewhere around here. Yes, without a doubt. It's got to be one of these doors. It smells of rotten flesh. I don't think this is the right door. No. But let's call that a tip. If any door smells like rotten flesh is under it, leave. Smells of blueberry pie. This must be the rotten present. I told you she does not live here. Madam, I know it's you. Could you please let me in? I'm sorry, come in please. I wonder what the deal is. Well, she's a pleasant looking lady. All smiley. Madam, I know. I'm sorry I had to do this, madam. Can you get me a little more time? I can pay the debt if you give me another week, please. I'm sorry. I hate doing this. I must seize this property. Okay, where'd I go? This is all I have. I'm sorry, madam. My guy's a dick, isn't he? I'm sorry, I shouldn't be crying like this. I just have memories here. I understand, madam. Now, where are my memories? Would you like to have a cup of tea? I'd rather have a cup of coffee, if possible. So, this lady, I'm going to trust that she's not going to poison my cup of coffee. But I don't, personally. I wouldn't drink it, I'll tell you that. It's a rocking chair, every granny has one. Well, of course. It's in the standard, uh, granny kit, you know? It's in the granny booster set. There's not much to look around at. So maybe this picture could have done it? I, dude, I don't- that screeching noise is creepy as shit, isn't it? I can't leave now, even if I want it. Is this in real time? There we go. It's a wedding photo of Mr. Mr. Goodwin, but I believe it's a widow man. Oh man, I shouldn't be doing this. So clearly, I am a uh, debt collector. No, there's blood. There's blood now going down the screen and the creepy deepy music. And now it's gone. I'm sorry, sorry dear. Afraid I run out of coffee. Can I get something else instead? No, thank you. Then. This movie will have to move out by the end of the month. I'm very, truly sorry. Well, that was weird, but a little underwhelming so far. I, I honestly figured I'd be doing something like... I don't know, I don't know anything about this game, and I like to go into games like this blind because uh, I like to let them stand on the merit of the storytelling and charm and all the little perks and things that usually make them a good game. I don't really know anything about this one, so... Okay, so clearly there's something else going on. He was spooky to get about, and that door just flew open. This is probably a very bad idea. Yeah, usually in a horror movie, this is the part where everybody screams at the screen. Alright. Living room. I'm guessing this is a safe spot. Game save, whatever that means. It's a little, little wall break. It's locked. I need a key. I can't see shit. Holy cow, that's... That's the dude's head missing there. I turned it off, but there was a power button. So clearly, oh shit, there's a note. What comes around goes around. Fuck it. So clearly this is a, a family game. Good for the kids, you know. I'm just kidding. Like, guys, uh, don't, don't let your kids play this. Seriously. Calm down. What the hell is that? Relax, it's a lead singer radio head. 
the node oven. It's an node oven. Okay, so we can do that. So this feels like it should be a point and click type game, but it's not. I find that interesting. Oh shit, it's freezing on here. There's something in the bathtub, let's see. It's cold. There! This might come in handy. Let's see to see what item you just found. Press the release of space. Press the attempt. Use the item whenever interacting. New and item active. Okay. Ready to use the ice cube with the bathtub. I won't put it back there. If you want to search for its own object, it's running something in the brain, so it won't be slot. Now try searching the bits of a gun. I don't need another cube. Well, it's safe to say he doesn't need another ice cube. See what I did there, guys? I don't need to pee. You sure you don't, buddy? You heard that weird ass creature. So, okay, so I don't know why I'm thinking of doing this, but because I don't have anything else, let's try to put the ice cube. Boom! I knew it! A key! Well, hunky dory! I found a key! Never let me say hunky dory again, guys, that was awful. There's a living room here. The body is gone. That's not good. Eh? I don't know, dude. Unlock the door. It's that sound again. Yeah, that's monsters if ever we heard it. Windows boarded. It's empty. It's empty. It's in here. I don't know, like this. It's empty again. It's a pretty effective little game. I found a horror book. Hello, my honey. Hello, my darling. Hello, my rectangle girl. I wonder if there's a secret passage, eh? Right? It could be the right place for that book, you nerd. You don't know. Anyway. Well, there is a thing too. Let's look here. Oh, huh, what's that? Another book fucked out. I think I know where to put this. Puzzles, y'all. Yeah, we're in puzzles now. I wonder what it is with horror games and puzzles, eh? What I tell you guys? Secret door. Secret door. Holy shit. I'm not gonna lie, that made me jump just that. What? I'm not reading all this. I'm reading it, but I'm not reading it out loud because you guys can read it. Guys are very weird. I wonder if my guy's aware that he looks like he works for uh, animatronics. Shit. It's a real elephant. Run, dude. Run. Run. Look at his face. This is insane to be with it. Is it supposed to happen? No, no, can I run? 
Dios. I'm trying to run. Go, buddy, go, 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 run, 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 run. Why is this elephant so fast? Get away from me, you freaky thing. Oh my god, it sounds like. What happened now? What a day that was. I still feel horrible when I was giggling. I need some coffee to wake up. All sorts of weird junk here. I hear you, buddy. Okay, so. He is definitely a person who enjoys uh, uh, quite a bit of uniform. There you go, coffee. Really, is this going to be one of those games? Yeah, knew this was going to... knew that was going to happen. Or at least I knew that was going to be an option to do that. I just use the window. Dip out and get some pop camera. Look that one. Oh, right there. Okay. Oh, okay. Um. Uh, so, so far, cute little game. Um, not as spooky as I expected. Definitely a horror game. But not really horrible. giant head people. The apartment is cranky. Who said it? So basically, this is the thing about going crazy. I'd also like to note it looked like it was running a lot of sick. is interesting. Um, there's a lot they seem to do with this, with the very muted faded colors. That I, I actually really enjoy this, but I do think that with just a little color here and there, a little more 
uh, to accentuate. You can see there is some color. The lighting and all that stuff is very muted, but I think there should be a little more, in my opinion. I'm not gonna knock the game, uh, I mean, for one thing, the price I couldn't do that, it's free. But for two, uh, I didn't really, I didn't mind it. So far, it's been a rather entertaining game. Very easy to follow, so far. Despite it having some spooky dooky moments. Um, nothing that I feel is over the top bad or anything. More uh, philosophical, I think. Go back to the old creepy ass hermit's villain. I'll cut him hobbit. I mean hermit. One or the other. I don't know. I just wanted to know what's happening. That'd be cool. Probably not realistically, but you know. It's gonna be some crazy stuff we gotta do just to light a fire. Uh, this is definitely one of those like definitely one of those action games where I feel like they really need to look at that. Perfect. So obsessed with that. I'm gonna go down a limb here and guess that the developer of this was not uh, an English speaking person by nature. Not that that matters, it really doesn't. I'm just going to say. Alright, alright. Okay, now we're on the case of the missing dog. Like in every little dark corner in this whole place, it would be fun.
and keep saving the game. Um, no, I think this is an interesting game. Uh, it's uh, certainly different. And as I said, you know, it's a free one that I found. Uh, certainly unique. I'll say that. That door is locked to the courses. Is the dog good again? Not so that's my first key. So let's ask the dude about it. Mr. Cotter. Come here, Cotter. I'm not sure how that helps. Alright, if it means to help. Me crazy. I suspect the actual food or what I'm actually looking for is out here. It's delightful too convenient that it would all be in the house, and the house is not damn big. Well, I guess it is all in the house. Oh. Oity toity. At least give my time. Nothing. So, let us go back there. Look. If I can fix old man Winter's problem, alright? So, this door, this door, this door. Living room. I'm going to do this. Bedroom connected to the right. Locked door. And then, this one connected to the kitchen. I think that's all of them. This kitchen one connected to the bathroom. We have another one. This is what I was hoping for. Let's look at this other one again. Is it here? Or is it here? Ah! Oh. Okay, let's put on the right. Is this one I think that's a good one? I do wonder what it is though, it's a lot of these um, puzzle games where they turn into horror games. Or horror games that turn into puzzle games like this, basically. So if I could get that right, it is. Okay. Right. But I got into this TPS dog to take it through first. It's clearly the dog. Actually, stinky dog. Uh, 
I don't know. I kind of expected more creepiness or more monsters or I don't know. Something a little spookier than this, let's say. something maybe a little more Silent Hill-ish. Uh, I am happy that this game has held my interest at least. It's an, a rather uh, interesting game, to put it mildly. I'm not quite sure what to make of it. I feel like this does going through a lot of guilt. Oh, that is a no step. What can I use? What can I use? All right, Conan O'Brien, but then we go. Yeah, this is definitely a interesting game. Uh, I'm trying to think of something to compare it to. I feel like you were going for a David Lynch Twin Peaks vibe here. And partially succeeded. I can't say it's as spooky as I expected it to be. Not that that's bad or anything. I just, uh, oh, okay, alright. Well, that's going to be useful later. Um, but I will say that. This, uh, this does indeed have a bit of merit with it. There we go. I don't know if this will help anything, but we're going to see if it works. And maybe I can find something to help the dog. What did I do? What's that? There's blood everywhere. Okay. The glove of Michael Jackson. I'm gonna go now and get the dog. Get Fido the Spots to do this thing. This seems like it might be a short game. If my duty is correct, this would be a very short game, yes. Because if I'm right, there's only this other thing here. It reminds me slightly of this other one I played about a dude who... I was worried he had to wear a mask or something and he was in an apartment complex. Anybody else know what I'm talking about? It was a 2D game. Um, there's a game called Clear out there that I own, I've never done. Um, but I might. If you guys want to, I own it. Um, that could be a let's play. There you go. Ashes, go home. Bonus, if you all know what that game is, uh, what that quote is from, what game that is, ah, if you all know what quote that game, you know what I'm saying. Awesome. How the hell am I getting back now? Uh, basically, what I'm saying here is, I, I'm wondering if you all know what game that quote is from. If you do, drop it in the comments below. Sweet. And we're outie. Get the papers, my friend. And these assholes again. Call me son.
cute. Clearly this is a... a... what do you call it? A commentary on greed and morality and all that. It has its own merits. Um, definitely not what I expected out of this game. I really expected this to be a more weird, more warped, monster code sort of thing, maybe, I don't know. Uh, we're gonna end it here, though, for today's Let's Play, guys. We have some great ones coming up this week as well. Subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, give us a like. Boom. Share us on your social media stuff if you like. That would be a great deal to help us. And, uh, as always, um, drop us a comment. Tell us what games you want to see us do. Um, and we will see you next time. Have a good day.